This is section 76 of Mark Twain Speeches by Mark Twain. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Charity and Actors by Mark Twain. Read by John Greenman. Address at the Actors Fund Fair in the Metropolitan Opera House, New York, May 6, 1907. Mr. Clemens, in his white suit, formally declared the fair open. Mr. Daniel Froman, in introducing Mr. Clemens, said, we intend to make this a banner week in the history of the fund, which takes an interest in every one on the stage, be he actor, singer, dancer, or workman. We have spent more than forty thousand dollars during the past year. Charity covers a multitude of sins, but it also reveals a multitude of virtues. At the opening of the former fair, we had the assistance of Edwin Booth and joseph jefferson in their place we have today that american institution and apostle of wide humanity mark twain as mr froman has said charity reveals a multitude of virtues this is true and it is to be proved here before the week is over mr froman has told you something of the object and something of the character of the work. He told me he would do this, and he has kept his word. I had expected to hear of it through the newspapers. I wouldn't trust anything between Froman and the newspapers, except when it's a case of charity. You should always remember that the actor has been your benefactor many and many a year. When you have been weary and downcast, he has lifted your heart out of gloom and given you a fresh impulse. You are all under obligation to him. This is your opportunity to be his benefactor, to help provide for him in his old age and when he suffers from infirmities. At this fair no one is to be persecuted to buy— if you offer a twenty-dollar bill in payment for a purchase of one dollar, you will receive nineteen dollars in change. There is to be no robbery here. There is to be no creed here. No religion except charity. We want to raise two hundred and fifty thousand dollars, and that is a great task to attempt. The President has set the fair in motion by pressing the button in Washington. Now your good wishes are to be transmuted into cash. By virtue of the authority in me vested, I declare the fair open. I call the ball game. Let the transmuting begin. End of Charity and Actors by Mark Twain Read by John Greenman